house. How is everybody doing this morning? Oh my gosh. Wow. I'm doing collective readings here. This is the first one. Somebody is in wish fulfillment right now. What a beautiful thing. Wow. Okay. Ugh. Okay. This could have come after significant heartbreak here. Significant heartbreak. Um, you had to really, really pull in your strength here. I feel like... I feel like this was devastating, devastating. Somebody could have lost everything, um, you know, like houses, club. I mean, just, you know, like 3D stuff, houses, cars, uh, maybe they're homeless. Um, somebody else could have lost somebody or partnership or something that really meant a lot to them. This was devastating for somebody and you're being called Okay, or you have already mastered this art of bringing in strength because I see somebody that is sitting in wish fulfillment right now. Okay, coming into this. Okay, so um, if you're experiencing this deep loss, my heart goes out to you. I love all of my viewers and I wish all of the souls good, good health, good healing and joy, prosperity, abundance. Um, I just, uh, I see you making it through though. That's why it's showing the strength card. Okay. I see you making this through and the lessons that you're going to be learning from this are going to serve you for the rest of your life here. Yeah. We've got this Empress card. Wow. This is quite the reading here. Okay. Somebody here, you know, somebody could be going through what, you know, some, a lot of people will talk about it as an awakening. Somebody could be really starting, um, you know, like this loss motivated them uh, to really create something new here. Um, for some of you also, if this was a loss, uh, you know, somebody could be pregnant here and that's going to be a legacy. That's going to be the legacy here. And if that's your situation where maybe you've lost a partner um, and you're pregnant, again, my heart goes out to you. Please, please, please take really good care of yourself here. That's really important. Okay. Um, I see someone has been has been trying possibly to come around you, uh, energies that have come around you that want to hold you back, that want to hold you down here. And spirit is telling you not to take the bait. I believe that you guys see completely past all of these illusions, okay? Like you're you're not going to be taking the bait. Instead, okay, you're weaving into this Queen of Wands here, which is about taking action. This is about being nurturing. This is about passion, goal-oriented, soul pur purpose, growth here. Some of you could have possibly um, some some divine feminine energy around you that that is helping as well here okay um i do see that there has been again there's been some devastation around you okay like i said some of you might have lost a home you might have lost your savings okay you know there's a lot of scams out there all that stuff um but know that the community is going to be coming together here Okay, this is actually a victory card over this tower. Whatever this is, you are being protected. You are being guided here. Um, wow. What about this Empress Spirit? I'm going to shuffle these again real quick. To come off with that wish fulfillment right off the get-go... And go into such devastation. This is an interesting reading here. Okay, yeah. I have a King of Cups coming in here. So you've got this, this Queen of Wands and this King of Cups. And that's kind of a really beautiful partnership. Whether you're representing both of these energies. Or, you know, maybe you're bringing that other energy in for you. Because she's all about manifesting. Making things happen. And the, the King is all about keeping things you know, on, based in love and compassion, right? And fairness. And I've got justice coming in here. I've got justice. I do feel like some of you will be getting an apology from someone. Okay. 
Uh, yeah, this is somebody that kind of misperceived a situation. All right, spirit is guiding you towards calmer waters here. I'm going to ask about this person or that energy, please. Yeah, this is somebody that for some reason, and I'm getting it could be substance abuse, um, and it doesn't have to be, you know, um, you know, it could be somebody that's gone through their own healing. I feel like somebody was really off balance here and really just stressed out and overworked. And this, this is what I got the reading on, you know, this betrayal or this loss. Okay. This was not malicious. This person just, um, they either, you know, it was either an actual illness Okay, or um, <clears throat> they were, I just hear it wasn't, it, as much as it, maybe they, they directed it towards you, it wasn't personal. It had, it was all about them, okay, is what led to this. And it, it was in your peripheral, okay? Yeah, you're going to be getting some assistance here, and you're going to have some decisions to make moving forward. All right. Spirit wants you to know that the drama is over. Okay. I feel like you guys have stopped engaging in it. There you go. There is the star. Okay. Some of you might not be seeing all the opportunity that's sitting, sitting right in front of you. Okay. I feel like somebody needs to maybe ask for help. If you need help, ask it. I do feel like there are people around that can help you. Okay? I've got boundaries up. Yeah. I'm thinking this has to do with this situation. You have learned a lot. You have grown a lot. Okay? And I feel like, <clears throat> excuse me, as you're moving forward here, <clears throat> you're going to be in a position where you're actually going to be helping others. Somebody might be teaching uh somebody somehow somebody's in a situation where they are able to help guide others because you've got a lot of kingdom energy and this empress energy um you know that's about putting things out to help others yeah action action harvest there you go the reminder here is to move forward in a balanced way take care of yourself take care of others right Take care of what you need to take care of. I'm going to get an Oracle card for you. Hey, please remember to check out the description box, my store. If you're enjoying these types of readings, please let me know. It does take time and energy to put these out. Yeah, I've got the ever unfolding rose. It's not happening to you. It's happening for you. And we've also got take a break, a life's work, not a season. Get off the treadmill. The uh, other thing I would say here as well is to really try to stay in that heart space, that higher self frequency and energy. Okay. Yeah. A new day, right? Letting go of what no longer serves you. Self love, right? And integration. A lot of us are doing this right now. A lot of people have been studying and building and growing. And it's, you know, it takes a little bit to integrate that. Notice the two threes. Threes are the trinity, mind, body, spirit, mind, body, soul. And, you know, for some of you, this is going to integrate on more than one level. Okay? This is going to integrate on a lot of levels. So you need to kind of let that dust settle. I also feel like from... You know, whatever this was, you know, it takes time to heal these things. The main thing I want you to take from this reading, and Spirit wants you to take from this reading here, okay, is this Empress, this Wish Fulfillment, this Strength card, all right, that, that things are coming together. When you start to take the actions, there is going to be a harvest for you. We've got the King of Cups as well. You might have people around you as well that are supportive, okay? Love, right? Really genuinely supportive, really genuinely wants you to do well. Oops, excuse me. Again, the reminder to move forward in balance, not to take the bait, okay? 
to see past those illusions. I'm just really getting that this, these opportunities and what is being given to you, I feel like the star is your energy here. What's being given to you is justice for the work that you've done. Like I feel somebody getting recognized for work that they've done. Okay? Anyway, I hope this has been helpful for you. Please take good care of yourselves. Take good care of each other. And as always, always, guys, be kind out there.